Hey, what's up everybody? This is Eric. Hey, I was on the uh, cruise this past week and Brian was on there and uh, I got to tell him about this strategy that I was trying out. Um, I know I posted one uh, last week, week before. Um, that system seemed to work real well on the single zero wheel. Um, I was able to play it for, I'd say, hour long sessions, probably about four hours total. And, uh, you know, got about 400 points off of that system. Um, so I figured, well, I had this other system that I wanted to try that about a, a month ago, I thought, um, you know, instead of focusing on the board, the layout of the board, <clears throat> I would focus on the wheel itself. I'll, uh, I'll, put, I'll put a picture up and describe it a little bit. Um, I'm calling the system yin and yang um, because if you look at the wheel and the way the wheel counts, um, you know, you have the, the right side, the left side, the yin and yang, uh, ever how you want to uh, say it. But if you, if you take the wheel, let's say 12 numbers on one half or 12 numbers on the other half, and you lay them out in a particular pattern on the board, um, it, it's pretty easy to remember the pattern once you see it a few times. And uh, so that system, it takes $12 to cover 12 numbers. And I figure, well, if it hits one side of the wheel, more often than the other, then it, you know, it could be a profitable system. So I was like, well, let me try that. I want to give that a try this week. And, um, it did fairly well the first time I tried it. Um, but then, um, I, I was up like 200 bucks. I bought in with 200, I was up 200 and I kind of backed out and called it, you know, said, uh, you know, that was time to leave. And, um, I waited about an hour, two hours. I went back in with the $200 profit and sat down and I lost it all. So, you know, so whatever strategy, it always works until it doesn't. So that was definitely one of those times where it didn't work. Okay. So then later, I guess it was a Thursday night, give or take, I went and I sat down. I had a hundred dollars in my wallet. <clears throat> so I'm like, well, let me try it with a hundred dollars and, but I'm going to change it up a little bit. And so I'm going to show you the change that I made to it. So if you take $12, I look at which side of the wheel just hit. So let's say the left side just hit. All right, I would bet on the right side of the wheel at that point. And so I would bet $12, cover my 12 numbers. And then if one of them hits, you know, that's a, you know, you get paid 35 to one, so that's $36. So then I take that $36 and I spread it across the 12 numbers. So it gives an average of $36. And I checked with the uh, the pit boss and made sure about what my average was. And at that time, he said I was averaging forty dollars a bet. You know, I was starting with twelve dollar, I was increasing to uh, thirty six dollars. And so I'm like, well, I'm I'm perfectly fine with that because that was four dollars more than what my average truly was. And so I sat there and I played it um, for you know three hours, just over three hours. And I started with a hundred dollars and I left with $800. So at that time, the system worked. You know, it, it did what I was hoping it would do, but if you start with the $12, you get the win, you take the $36 and put it across the exact same 12 numbers. If that side of the wheel hits, your chances are really good that it's gonna land on one of your numbers. Okay, so that $36 wins $105, which gives you a total of $93 profit for a $12 bet. Okay. So, uh, I'm going to run that system out. I'm going to say, um, I was, I was going to do like 25, 30 rolls. Let's just see what happens. It's kind of what I figure if you're at the table and per hour, you know, you're probably going to get 25 to 30 rolls or spins, you know, per hour, give or take. Um, so let's, uh, Let's roll it out and let's see what happens. I'll see you back in a minute.
All right, so there you go. I, uh, I spun it 29 times. Um, that's kind of equivalent to maybe an hour um, at the table. Um, you know, I had a few good hits that you could see. Um, you know, so you take that $12, you turn it into $105. It was pretty good. You know, so it's not as, it didn't hit as well as it did for me on Thursday on the cruise, um, but you know, I'll take a $73 profit, um, any day, you know, so, but on the cruise, what I realized, what I noticed was, you know, that $12 bet the going up to $36, you know, I, I kind of talked with the pit boss when I kind of got the system going, you know, probably 15, 20 minutes in and asked him, Hey, you know, what, what's my average? And he says, I have you at a, a $40 average. Okay. So, um, I played for three, a little over three hours and, you know, made, you know, just right at a hundred points, just maybe just over a hundred points an hour. Um, so, I mean, it's, you know, works out pretty good. And I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm putting a hundred dollars at risk. So let's just see what happens, you know? Um, but as you saw, when I put the 12 out, you know, when it hits, so they get the 35 to one. Okay. I put 36 out on three numbers. If they double up or if it hits, then I make $105. And so what I do is I ask the dealer, if you would give me two green chips. So they'll give me two green chips. They then give me 55 of the orange, okay, or whatever color you're playing with at the time. So I, I take the $50 and I put it in my pocket. Okay, so I'm sure, you know, I'm getting $50 back, you know. So, um, you know, so every time that's kind of what I do. So I get $12 out there. I put 36 out there. When it pays 105, I ask for two green chips. Put two green chips in your pocket, okay? And just kind of keep playing, you know, with your winnings, you know? So after a while, you get, you know, you get your $100 just having your pocket. So then you're like playing with their money at that point, you know? So, um, you know, as far as the betting strategy goes, um, I'll sometimes I'll just, you know, look at the wheel and see which side's hitting, which side's not. You know, if, if one side hits and I'm like, oh, well, I feel like the other side's going to come up, so I'll bet the other side. And then, you know, but then sometimes I feel like, well, you know, one side's hotter than the other. Like some people like to play the 17 and the 20. Um, you know, so if you're, if you're one of those kind of people, then, you know, stick with that side of the board um, or that side of the wheel. Um, you know, if you look at the strategy and how the, the layout is and how to play that side of the wheel, you just set that pattern out and let it ride, you know, just keep putting $12 on it, $12 on it until it hits. And then you double, you know, then you take your winnings and you put it on there and there you go. So, um, um, whatever strategy, you know, it works until it doesn't. So, um, maybe that was some information for you guys. So after equivalent of an hour worth of rolling, then that was a profit of $73. Okay. So I got my hundred back and $73. So, uh, give it a try. See how it goes. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hopefully it was uh, informative for you and, uh, happy cruising. See ya.